Herbed Pearled Couscous, AKA Israeli couscous. It's gonna be so good. Couscous loves a little bit of fat. So I'm using butter and a little bit of olive oil. It's really good because the olive oil starts the cooking. And they both start with onions because those are delicious base aromatic flavors. Once the onions have cooked down in the butter with a little bit of seasoning, now it's time for the dry herb. I use rosemary and then that's gonna season the onions. There's onions and butter and you get the rosemary in there. That makes couscous delicious. So a lot of people, when they make couscous, they boil their stock or their water first, and then they put the couscous in, but I'm all about building flavor. And if you toast this couscous and just gently toast it and the butter and the herbs, that's how you build flavor. That's how you make something really exciting in around 30 minutes. Yeah, get it covered, get it really nice and toasted. You can see things are already starting to happen with the butter and the onions and the rosemary. And as soon as I put the couscous in, you wanna give it a quick shot of salt. So the couscous is really nice and toasted, and then that's the time to add the stock, because there's already some big, bold flavors in there. You could use chicken stock, but why would you? It's fish night, I'm using veg stock. And couscous cooks pretty quick. So I just cover the couscous, let it boil. I'm gonna use just good old fashioned parsley, but most people take the leaves off the stems, there's really good texture and really good flavor in the stems, so I run my knife through all of it. Don't be shy, don't waste anything. Use the stems, use the leaves. That's just delicious. Just to finish it, parsley. A lot of parsley, and then a little bit of basil. When you add the herbs at the end, it stays fresh, it stays fragrant, it stays electric, and that's the best way to get a lot of flavor out of herbs. Just finish with the end, a little bit of the lemon juice, one more sprinkling of salt, and just mix it all in. And it's really nice and fluffy. If you just, it's so easy to cook. You just boil it, let it sit for a little bit, add some fresh herbs, and it's really, really, really exciting. Delicious. Nothing fancy for the couscous. It's just so flavorful and there's already so much going on. Just get it onto a nice plate. Stack it up real high. Oh, it's so delicious. You have to try this Israeli couscous. I love the big balls of couscous. Just a little basil to finish. That's delicious. Full of flavor, full of texture, full of TLC.